So with the first half of Season 9 wrapped up, along with Desk of Death Battle taking its place, I thought, hey, why not predict what's gonna come in the second half? Of course, there's tons of possibilities of what may come, so if you have any other ideas that you think could be possible, let me know in the comments. Now before we go on to the new stuff I have in mind, let's just have ourselves a little refresher and just talk about the matchups I talked about last time. Hey, you wanna hear a dad joke? Yeah, what's up? You being born. So, first things first. Cole McGrath from Infamous versus Alex Mercer from Prototype. I've said this before and I'll gladly say it again. This is the matchup that makes you think, why hasn't Death Battle done this yet? It's essentially the perfect legacy fight. And not only that, it would be so damn good in 3D. As for who wins, most likely Cole. Is it a stomp in Cole's favor? Yes. But is it a cool stomp? Yes. Another good contender to happen this season would be Bill Cipher from Gravity Falls versus Discord from My Little Pony. Yes, this. Now some would make the very obvious counter argument and say MLP's been officially blacklisted, but I mean, it didn't stop them from doing Yoda vs King Mickey or even including Saitama to the series, so if they can do that, I'm pretty sure they can bring MLP back for at least one more run. As for who wins this matchup, Discord, by like a very large margin. As a matter of fact, this matchup actually grew on me so much that I even made a death out of it. You could pause the radio if you want. The next matchup on my list is Noel Vermillion from Boys Blue versus Igus from Persona 3. And I really want this fight just for the fact that we can bring back Blaze Blue. I mean, the last time we got it, it was with Rockna, and that was seven years ago. Saying Blaze Blue needs to come back is a huge understatement. And hey, speaking of franchises that take God knows how long to come back, here's Mewtwo vs. Black War Greymon. Just like Noel vs. Igus, I specifically want to see this just to see Digimon back. Unlike Blaze Blue though, it's been four years since we've seen Digimon on the show, but it would be so damn cool to see it come back. And finally, you know me, Ruby vs. Maka is literally my number one most wanted, and until it happens, will stay my number one most wanted. Although, with Rooster Teeth trying to keep the Death Battle curse dead, this matchup could happen sooner rather than later, which in turn could also mean Ruby has a chance of losing. Fuck. So those are all of the matchups from previously. But now, we go into new material. I don't- I don't sound like a muscle man! You say, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna start this bit by talking about the biggest elephant in the room. The season finale. Now I see three really good contenders, but we're gonna start with the obvious. Galactus vs Unicron. The fact that this hasn't happened is a sin. Like, this has to be the season finale for this year. But on the off chances that the finale isn't it, I'd say Simon vs Kyle is a good second choice. This has the potential to not only be a good finale, but the best season finale. I mean, beating Saitama vs Popeye? Yeah, it's a bit of a hard thing to do, but hey, I'd be happy if it did. And hey, if it's somehow not this, then definitely Bowser vs Eggman. It basically has the same legacy as Mario vs Sonic, so I doubt they wouldn't pull this off. Oh, and I can care less about what you say about it. It has to be an army fight. It's basically perfect for that. Those are my three choices for the finale, but of course I have a lot more to talk about. Such as, back to our topic with Sonic, Movie Sonic vs. Anne Bonchoy from Amphibia. Now, you may be thinking, what about Luz from the Owl House? And while that is a good option, I feel like Movie Sonic fits more with them. Especially when you consider not only their very similar stories, but they're pretty similar movesets, which I think would clash perfectly. Now, I would be mad if Anne ends up fighting Luz instead, but it would just break my heart seeing Luz lose, unless somehow Luz gets a boost. 
But until then, I'm going with Movie Sonic vs. Ant. Now this next one, semi-interesting at best. They're gonna do another Flash episode. Considering how the last two seasons went, a Flash episode is definitely a certainty. And just like the previous two episodes with Flash, it's going to be horrible. That's right, I'm saying it. Barry's was the only good episode. You can fight me on that. But let's just save my terrible taste for another day and talk about a matchup that's actually good. Grill vs. Megamind. This matchup alone already has tons of signs of it happening this year. Zatanna's presentation and Scarlet Witch vs. Zatanna? Megamind. Omni-Man vs. Homelander's track being called Diabolical Invincible Me? Sounds like Despicable Me. At all that, with this matchup being in a Death Battle cast, and the crew showing interest in it, I think it's pretty much guaranteed that Groove vs. Megamind is going to happen. Now I do have one more matchup that I think could happen. That matchup, Ash Ketchum for Pokemon versus Yugi Moto slash Yama Yugi from Yu-Gi-Oh. This matchup is arguably the most popular versus matchup of all time. Not counting Mario vs. Sonic or Goku vs. Superman, of course. But the one thing Ash vs. Yugi has in his favor is that you can do so much with both of their movesets, quote unquote. You can have so many of Ash's Pokemon against Yugi's his monsters. As for how much they would use, <laughs> all of them. Ash vs. Yugi would just be a great episode all around. And I will be damned if they waste any of that good potential. And just like that, those are all my predictions of what may happen. Will I be right? <laughs> no. On second thought, I might have missed one. No, no. I think it's called Trixie versus Cherno? Cherno? Yeah, th this. I don't know. I think it's neat. Spread it. Spread it.